ஹாய் ஹலோ வணக்கம் அண்ட் வெல்கம் பேக் டு அட் அனதர் எபிசோட் ஆன் லிட்டில் ஸ்லா யூடியூப் சேனல் ஸோ டுடே இன் திஸ் வீடியோ வி வில் சி அபவுட் ஒன் ஆஃப் தி போல் கொஸ்டின் விச் ஐ ஹாவ் ஆஸ்க்ட் இன் மை லிங்க் இன் போஸ்ட் ஸோ த போல் இஸ் மெயின்லி அபவுட் இட்ஸ் இட்ஸ் அ கைண்ட் ஆஃப் அ பேசிக் கொஸ்டின் விச் எவ்ரி ஜே மீட்டர் ஆர் எனி பர்ஃபார்மன்ஸ் டெஸ்டர் வுட் நோ பட் ஐ ஜஸ்ட் ஆஸ்க்ட் ஸோ தட் ஐ கேன் ஹெல்ப் the people to understand the concepts better the geometer better and that's the reason i have asked this question and um i could see uh, the results uh, uh in a in a mixed way like i could see uh, a combination a mix of uh, results with both the correct and the incorrect answers so that's the reason i'm just bringing up uh, this video to explain uh, in a very uh, quick and in a most understandable way so the question is uh, which component of geometer is used to simulate multiple users accessing a web application so this is the question and uh, this question is very straight forward so we are going to uh, ask like i'm asking which uh, component is going to uh, is i mean we are going to use it to simulate multiple users to access a web application so let me explain all the choices and by the end by the end you would know what is the right answer so so here I, uh, you could see uh, in fact uh, it's very evident that most of the people like 93% of people have chosen uh, the third group as the answer that's the right answer but still let me give you a quick overview or a quick understanding on all all, all the four uh, uh, components so firstly uh, the sampler so sampler in geometer so let me just open uh, the geometer and i can show you so if uh, just a second so if i'm going to add a sampler so in fact i cannot even add a sampler without a thread group so if you go to a thread group and add the thread group we have multiple samplers so samplers in geometer i mean these samplers in geometer are used to simulate different types of requests so you can generate a http request or you can generate a bolt request or an ftp request or a http request so they define that type of interaction something like a get request or a post request in, ca- in case for example like if i'm uh, adding a http request which is a basically a sampler and that's the first choice here um if you would see uh, the first choice uh, of all these four if you could see that's a a basic sampler that each virtual user used to perform so that cannot be the answer because the question is what component is used to simulate multiple users but here we are not uh, we are not using samplers to simulate the users but instead we are using samplers to simulate the type of request so it's very uh, they both are completely different so simulating users is different from simulating the different type of request so this i think would be the reason for most of the people uh, to get confused on uh, choosing the answers so it's not uh, so sampler is not basically simulating users but a sampler is used to simulate the requests and then the listener yeah I, i'm very happy that enough uh, you have selected the uh, cho- the re- listener because we all know listeners in geometer are used to collect and display the results of the test execution and they provide various types of reports and visualizations to analyze the performance of the application under test and i'm really happy uh that people i mean like most of us have a very good understanding on what listener is and then when it comes to the controller so controller in geometer are used to define the logic and flow of the test plan so if i go to the geometer and if, when i add a controller so the logic controller so if you can, you can see like we have lots of controllers the if controller the transaction the loop the while controller the critical section the for each so we have like a lot of controllers to say so they actually define the logic and the flow of the test for example if i am choosing an if controller i can define a logic for example like if a particular condition is true i have to uh, emulate a per set of transactions or if it's false i have to emulate a different set of transactions so these controllers are used to define the logic and the flow of the test plan and then they control the execution of the samplers and other elements within the test plan by defining the order of execution or adding logics to the handle uh, to handle the conditions for example i can add any of the samplers in 
inside my controller but again when you are adding a sampler you are controlling or you are simulating different types of requests and not different users right so while uh, so we have seen about the samplers uh, listeners and controllers so samplers listeners and controllers are essential components of jmeter which we all know uh, which is part of a test plan again the thread group is specifically responsible so on top if you could see it's specifically responsible for simulating multiple users accessing a web application by defining the concurrency and the behavior of virtual users so i'll explain you to you how so the jmeter thread group is used to simulate multiple users so here you can see we can emulate the users multiple users so the thread group defines the number of virtual users which means the threads so users basically the threads and the pattern of their execution for example the ramp up period or the loop count and we can simulate concurrent users activity on our web application so that's why and that's the reason uh, we have chosen our uh, the uh, Thread group is the answer for this question, which is which component of JMeter is used to simulate multiple users accessing the web application. So let me just bring it again. So samplers are used to simulate different types of requests. Controllers controls the logic and the flow and thread groups are used to simulate multiple users accessing the web application. So I believe I have uh, given you some basic understanding on what the components of JMeter. I believe this video, I mean, like this information will definitely help you in your interviews and uh, in your discussions and while working. So with that, I come to an end and I believe this video would be very useful to you. So I will post another MCQ shortly and all the very best for your uh, career. And with that, I come to an end. So until I meet you in another interesting video, it's bye-bye for us. Chanmukam and Little Slaw.